of health and a vitamin from the company's physician, Dr. Ned. He's doing everything in his power, but there have been some deaths. Do not worry. I will, as always, be careful. I'll send an echo again soon. All my love, Hank. Beloved Anna, it is no longer rumors. Some curse has been set upon us here at Jacob's Cove. The dead are rising from their graves and are ravenous with a hunger for flesh. All work has stopped, and we're fighting for our lives. But fear not. Dr. Ned believes there's a way to stop the horror. I have volunteered to allow him to test an antidote on me. <laughs> it's the Skags, my dear. The filthy Skags will be our salvation. The doctor says they're immune to the ailment. I'm presently on my way to get this patient at the hospital outside of town. I know, I know it will be a success, and we will be together again shortly. Pray for me, Hank. Ah! <laughs> 
Our story began when the Hyperion Corporation decided they'd had enough of the treasure hunters. With the vault on lockdown, they had served their purpose, and now they were a drain on the economy. Why pay full price for weapons when you can take a five-finger discount off the nearest corpse? Hyperion was looking to clear up the drain, but those guys were one tough hairball. I thought you said the treasure hunters were the drain. Now they're the hairball? Uh, well, yes, uh, you see, the treasure hunters were blocking the flow of, uh, uh, and the grimy buildup of money and... Uh, this metaphor stinks. Uh, uh, shut up! Point is, Hyperion had a plan. The treasure hunters could handle all manner of beastie, bandit, and battalion, but they weren't expecting the interplanetary ninja assassin Claptrap. This Claptrap was programmed to take our boys out indirectly. Trapping, poisoning, spreading catty rumors around town. Nothing was off limits. He was smart. Too smart. He looked around and didn't like what he saw. Claptraps being subjugated, humiliated, obliterated. What we call programming, he called slavery. So, he rallied his fellow Claptraps and turned them against their corporate masters. What started as a rebellion became a revolution and take a wild guess who Hyperion called to clean up the mess. Atomic batteries to power, turbines to speed. Ooh, I wonder what this does. I'm going to need a nuclear reaction to generate the 1.21. Oh, hey, hello. Welcome to my secret lab. Secret lab? Terror pavilion, yes. I like that one best. Hey. Look like you're into experimentation. Maybe dabbled a bit in college? Head down to the Hyperion dump to find parts for my totally legit, in no way morally reprehensible secret project here. There should be plenty of scrapped claptraps right for the picking. Sure are a lot more of the buggers puttering around. It'll be easier than stealing candy from a dead baby.
Get shot! <laughs> 